gentlemen, time for round four. Let's meet our contestants. First of all, contestant number one, Chris Tool Putnam, currently serving in the Air Force 24 plus year. Chris, how you doing, guy? Thank you for your service, Chris. So you were here in Waikiki just tooling around? <laughs> Chris Tool. Okay, Edgar Ventura lives in Mililani and he likes fishing. Edgar, here's Edgar. Ventura Highway, here in Waikiki. Okay, here's Marco, Tony Two Hands Rico. Lives in Waipahu and his hobby is running. If I lived in Waipahu, I'd be running too. I'm kidding, I love Waipahu. Nathaniel Marquez lives in Mililani. Nathaniel, there you go, flying in. And for our final person up on the booth, or on the table, William Pretty Schmood Manaoli. He lives in Mililani. He's pretty schmood. Okay. You schmood. You schmood. <laughs> okay. We have our contestants. Are you ready? Yeah. Audience members, are you ready? Max. Go, Marco, go. Go, Marco, go. Ten minutes. Go, Marco, go. Ten go, Marco, go. minutes. Go, 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 go. Ten minutes. Looking good as always. Got ten minutes. Oh, oh, those are some big bites, man. Boy, you keep on those big bites, they're going to be gone in no time. Now that's using your tool. <laughs> Okie dokie. Looking good. Especially the pickles. The pickles help slide it down. Right? And the sesame seeds, they do absolutely nothing for it. Okay, they don't... They're like little pills, huh? Looking good? If you know the contestant, scream out their name. And don't forget, gang, if you have them, somebody up here that's your favorite and you want to donate in their name, come over here to the table over here. See Dick and everybody at this table. Say, I want to donate $10 for Tool from the Air Force. He's in the Air Force. He's serving us. I'd like to, in his name, I would like to go over here to Wounded Warriors in his name and make a donation. Okay? And even if you don't have uh, a favorite, if you see anybody over here, then please come on over here and make a donation. HON Channel 2. And if you can't get Channel 2, watch Channel 1 twice. That's what I used to tell Jordan Segundo all the time. Okay, looking good, looking good. Come on, Joel, you can do it, you can do it. Get it up here. The more you applaud for them, the more excited they get. They'll, like little puppy dogs, they go peeing when you pet them. <laughs> well, maybe that wasn't such a good <laughs> example. You must have learned that on the highway. Been to a highway in the sunshine. Somebody's gonna get that. Well, yeah, I guess in the Air Force, eating that many hamburgers is a little bit of a flighty job. Yeah. I, I don't know, let me find out. How many more minutes? Well, that's better than what they serve you in the Air Force, isn't it? Remember Lachlan Air Force Base when you went through basics? Remember the stuff they used to feed us there? <laughs> Boy, look at all the seasoning they get. A lot of this white season from the birds. Wow, Edgar, good job, man, good job. Whoa. Four more minutes, four more minutes. Give him four minutes for the law. This is so exciting that Bill's mustache is going, growing under his chin. 
<laughs> okay, three and a half minutes. Three and a half minutes. Don't you guys wish you were up here? I know you don't wish you was up here. Okay. Okay, hold it down now because you may be on the Channel 9 News tonight. And Channel 2 News also. Yeah, we had two also. Oh, they left? You might be on the Channel 2 News tonight because the other channel left. Three minutes. <laughs> Three more minutes. Boy. You can do it, you can do it. I got 5-4. We, we timed him at 5-4. Five, five. Oh, oh, okay. One and a half. Two and a half minutes. Give him two and a half minutes. More love, y'all. Anybody want one of these uh, Pakistani? Javier, tell us how, what you really feel. <laughs> really? Here we go. That's the countdown. 120. A minute 20. You can do it. You can do it. Smooth. You can do it, man. You can do it. We got a, what, tell, what kind of time we're looking at? Got it? <laughs> okay, how are we looking time-wise? Give them love, give them love, give them love! <laughs> Fifteen. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Put your burgers down. Big hand for our five contestants here. Final round of contestants. Let's give away more free stuff. You know why I like this part? Because it doesn't belong to me and it's free and we give it away. I love giving away other people's stuff. The contestant wins all, of, all around. Okay. Oh, this goes out to the person that gets the most sponsors. The, the, the contestants that were the people uh, paid for them or, or got the less time, right? Oh, the most donations. Oh, okay. The contestant that got the most station and the name. Oh, okay. We're going to do that at the very end. introduce all the uh, contestants to the table. Starting with David, Mr. Postman, Tui Puloto. Tui Puloto, he lives in Waikiki. And you can tag him at Mr. Post, uh, hashtag Mr. Po, P-O-5-T-M-A-N. All right, there we go. Boy, I had to look at that a couple times. And welcome contestant number two, Houston, Huey Moraine, Huey. You look like you just got out of a job chopping up stuff for, uh, what's that Japanese place down there where they wear those headbands? Contestant number three, Selena. Oh, I can't make out that last name, but Selena. Oh, the, well, how do you pronounce your last name? 
Easy for you to say. Unga unga. Okay, that's contestant number three. Contestant number four, Lamek Seafood. Hey, is that Thailand? What kind of name is that, Lamek? Peruvian. Oh, Peru. Oh, it's in the Bible. I'm gonna have to read Genesis, I guess. Rebrief myself. You get to an you get to an age and you feel you belong back in those days, right? Okay. That's our contestant number four. Contestant number five, Yusuke Sakamoto-san. Yusuke. Hi. Konnichiwa. Contestant number six, Jonathan Burkett. Jonathan. Ah, there's one of our winners right there. He knows the NFL. But he's too tiny to be part of it, right? <laughs> And now, Scott, Scott Wilfrey. I think that's Wilfrey, is it Scott? Wil Scott Wilfrey? Oh, Winfrey. Are you any relation to Oprah? Scott Winfrey. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I saw that look. Like, no. Okay, here's Scott. No. You're fine. We, we believe you. Have a seat. Have a seat. Scott, okay. Okay. Fail. I hope you don't fail on this burger eating contest now. Okay, here we go. Now we have our seven contestants. These are our final contestants. And stick around, because after this, we're going to find out who the winner, overall winners of this whole competition. And once again, on behalf of the shopping center here, Royal Hawaiian Shopping Center and Wolfgangs and Mona Wood, we want to thank all of you for, for participating. And of course, thank all of our sponsors and our Lieutenant Governor for being with us today, Max, all the volunteers. Here we go with our final competition. So, we, st we got them up. We're still waiting for more burgers. Okay. Okay, one, one more explanation in Japanese while we're waiting for the rest of our burgers to come down. Don't touch the burger. Here we go. We're ready. Here we go. Our final two. I was just getting ready to go out and uh, interview the audience here. Where are you guys from? Uh, originally from New Hampshire, now from L.A. All right. All right. From New Hampshire. Give it up for New Hampshire. L.A. I like L.A. because that's my name spelled backwards. L. Get it? Yeah. Okay. He's briefing all the contestants. And once again, for all of you joining us, they have 10 minutes to eat five half-pound hamburgers. <laughs> for great prizes. Okay. Here we go. That means they started. <laughs> Goody! Okay, here we go. The final one. Give them all a good big hand. Cheer them on. Cheer them on. Cheer on your favorite. Go, Goody! And if you have a favorite up here, like I said, like I keep saying, if there's somebody here that you would like to donate to for the uh, Wounded Warriors, Sixers, there you go, right there. Donate in his name. Donate, donate for David. He's been sitting here all day waiting for this. So go donate to Wounded Warriors for David. He's been really, he's been really patient sitting over there from the very beginning. Oh, now he's, now he's cheering him on in Spanish. You can cheer him on in Spanish, in Polish, in German, in Russian. Oh, see? Da, premier, no coach you like over there. Oh, looking good there, folks, man. Looking good. Okay. Cheer it on for our lady up here. 
cheering up for her. Being the only lady up here on the table, come and donate to her for the Wounded Warriors over here. Hey, even if it's 50 cents, whatever, come on over here and donate. Come and donate because this girl has blonde hair. <laughs> okay. Hey, he's saying something private and secret in Spanish. Okay. Come on, cheer him on. Everybody that's got a different language, come in and cheer him on in a different language. <laughs> How you guys doing out there? Happy 4th of July! Everybody going out to see the fireworks tonight, right? You gonna go out and check out the fireworks? Major fireworks tonight on the beach, on the Beach Park. It's a forking night. How <laughs> a forking night? You ain't gonna get no forking night. Oh, look at the doggy. Donate for this doggy. You see this little doggy? All right, this little doggy here is a wounded doggy warrior. So come in. Okay, here we go. H-O-M. So get home, watch the news, get out to see the fireworks, but please give these all a great big hand. One more time, round of applause. Keep the applause coming. Okay? Keep their spirits up. Keep their tummies going. Isn't this great? You don't gotta cook dinner tonight. <laughs> Three minutes. Three 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 minutes. Yes, 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 yes. Look at that. They get a blessing from heaven. They get to soften their buns with rain. Come on. Give it up. Give it up. Give it up. A minute what? One and a half minutes. Ninety seconds. 90 seconds. Keep them going, keep them going, keep those dogs moving. Looking good, looking good. This is my here didn't have anything better to do. Hey, I'll just go eat some free hamburgers. One minute. One more minute. Okay. Hey, crowd, everybody on the count of three, everybody give me a shaka sign. One, two, three. Shaka! This is being seen around the world. Okay. Okay. We're looking at less than a minute. We're looking at... How are we doing, timekeeper? 15 at 15. Okay. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and our Lieutenant Governor and everybody at Washington Place. And Max, our timekeeper. Okay, now this is the good part. We're gonna get everything, we're gonna get everything uh, all checked. Put this first annual 4th of July Wolf County Steakhouse Hamburger Eating Contest. Okay, now we're gonna clean off the table after all the pictures are done. Contestants, you may leave the table after they get all the pictures done. Everything tabulated. Appreciate Wolf Gang for supporting us here today too. So thank you everybody. Thank you, sir. Right on. Always a pleasure, Doug. Okay. And now 
we're going to tally up the scores and we're going to find out who the big winners are. I know a lot of you know, a lot of you have seen, one of these guys up here inhale that stuff in five minutes. So this is going to be really exciting, but there are other people. And now for our after show entertainment, somebody from the Dr. Phil show. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm in Jerry Springer. Okay. I hope, I hope you enjoyed your hamburgers, guys. <laughs> yeah, Waikiki. The place where you see just about everything. Okay. Thank you, judges. Put your hands together one more time for all of our judges. That's a lot of hard work to sit out in this sun doing all this, okay? What do you think, Lauren? Do you think you could eat five hamburgers in 10 minutes? Our mission, we take these folks out and give them socialized experiences, take them out whale watching, that sort of thing. Uh, luau's, we take them to uh, magic shows and so forth. And it all counts, by all accounts, the doctors tell us this, we're spot on in terms of socializing. We give them an opportunity to get together. Sometimes they would never get to these things. So thank you guys for coming out and supporting us. I gotta tell you, every piece of what's been donated today will go to the mission that I just described because we are all volunteers. Once again, can I get a, my volunteers to raise your hands over there? Denny, Janet, Cynthia, all those guys donate their time. So thank you and God bless America. God bless the USA. Aloha! God bless you, Guy, for your service. I personally now, I get to give away a gift certificate. Yay! put this on and of course all the folks here at the Royal Hawaiian Shopping Center and all the volunteers okay shall we go from third place down okay. oh the spirit award let me see who's got do I have the spirit I don't have the spirit award on here you want to do okay the spirit award so we had a little competition today for whoever raised the most money among all of our contestants and that person was going to win this beautiful spirit award because you know they're raising money for a very good cause and i know some of you have heard of the wounded warrior project so it gets a little bit confusing the wounded warrior ohana is a totally local nonprofit organization totally run by volunteers so all of your donations go straight to the veterans and, and the work they do is just really really amazing so to present the um spirit award I am going to give you back to Dick Rankin from Wounded Warrior Ohana. Okay, this might be my final time on the bike, so just one more time. Now, <laughs> no, don't say. But I want to thank Al, and I want to thank the Lieutenant Governor, I want to thank Mona, Bill, I want to thank all of you guys for the support to Wounded Warrior Ohana today. It's going 100%, as she said, to the mission, so thank you so much. And in that vein, we've got the Spirit Award, most donations, 240 bucks for this particular person, and it goes to Stephen Breen. Please come up, Stephen Breen. Prime time, prime beef, right on. Congratulations, guy. And he got free lunch. <laughs> Congratulations, Steve. Thank you, Aloha. It's a great cause. The Wounded Warriors is a great cause. The Wounded Warriors is a great cause. Thank you guys for going. Thank you so much. Aloha. Steve Green, congratulations. Thank you, Steve. Fantastic. Okay. Did you want to give away? Oh, that goes wrong with these here also. Okay. 
Okay, and now here are the winners of our of our contest. Three place awards, starting with the winner of a number round number five, contestant number three, David Tui Pulotu. David Postman. Congratulations. Let's get some photos up here. And his wounded warrior hat and bottle opener. What do you, you gotta have one of those. You gotta have a Heineken opener, right? But it says wounded warriors on it. And what's the gift certificate for? For how, what's the dollar amount for for for? Uh, it's fifty dollars. Fifty dollars he gets for uh, Wolfgang's. All right. Fifty dollar prize and fifty dollar gift certificate. Not bad for a day of eating burgers, huh? All right. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, Dave. Come over here, Dave. Whoa, whoa, Dave. Come here. Say, say a few words. Hey, I want to thank you guys for holding this event. I want to thank everybody that's here to support the Wounded Warrior Project over here. Thank you. And please donate some more after this. Thank you, Dave. Words well spoken. Well spoken. Okay, Can, then our second winner, our second place winner, is Javier El Maldito Mendez. Javier, muchas gracias amigo, lo siento amigo. Hundred dollar gift certificate, a hundred dollars, a hundred dollar cash prize and a certificate to Wolfgangs. Is that a matching hundred? Wow. Muchas gracias. Gracias a Wolfman de House por hacer esto. Hubo entre los concursantes cinco personas que hablaban español. Y sin embargo, fue el japonés el que estaba en el parlante. Somos mayoría, así que muchas gracias. Muchas gracias, Javier. Yeah, baby, what he said. Okay, congratulations, Javier. <laughs> Fantastic. We're gonna and all you winners stick around because we're gonna take a picture, a group picture with all of you winners. And now for our first, first, first place, place, place winner. First, first. <laughs> one, one, one. It started and stopped huh? in less than five, 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 six, six, six minutes. Yeah. Here we go. Number one, Edgar Ventura, with a time of five minutes and 17 seconds. Wow. So nobody fed you for a month? Uh, for about six hours. Six hours? Oh, poor thing, he only ate six hours ago. How's about a few words there, guy? Uh, Thank you for well, this competition. And he serves. I'm in the Army. U.S. Army. Congratulations and thanks for your service, man. Okay, got it? Bill, you gonna come over here? Bill, we need, we gotta get a picture. And then we'll do this one and then we'll do a group shot of all our winners. Did you all enjoy? Did you have fun? We're glad. Okay, all of our winners, please step to the front of the stage so we can get a group shot of all of you. Thank you. Maybe I can get one of them half pound burgers. The ones left over from the day. Oh, and everybody, please give a big hand to our MC, the host with the most, Mr. Al Watterson. I'd also like to thank all of my volunteers, all of you guys for coming out. Wounded Warrior Ohana, and you guys have to come next year because Bill Nickerson said he's going to give everybody a free burger who comes. Oh. Am I keeping you to your promise, Bill? Slider. Oh, it's a slider now. Okay, everybody, let's give a big hand to all of our winners, all our competitors, all of you guys that came out today, all 25 of you. Thank you so much. And we want to see you next year. Happy 14th.
4th of July and have a safe, safe holiday. Mahalo. Hold on, you guys. Here we go, you guys. All right, on three. Right over here. One, two, and three. One more. One, two, and three. Thank you.